could probably think my mom was a loser, but she wasn't. She wasn't, you hear me? She was married to my dad and everything was fine until he got killed in some freak tractor accident. Yeah, that's what I said. A freak tractor accident. I don't even remember my dad. Mom showed me his picture over and over, but I don't actually remember him. To me, my dad is the picture that my mom kept in a silver locket around her neck. The picture that mom would look at and cry over. She didn't have a job before the accident, but afterwards she got one cleaning hotel rooms. She didn't make very much money, though, and for years we kept kick getting kicked out of apartments because there wasn't enough money for food and rent. She never told me that was the problem. She'd just say, It's moving day, baby! And when I'd complain, she'd laugh and say, You'll love the new place. It's near the park. Or, Wait till you see all the kids. Or, This one's right around the corner from your school. No bus, no fuss. You'll be able to sleep in till eight. But the new place was always smaller and dirtier than the last place, with bars on more windows and bigger bugs in the kitchen. And every few months, angry people would pound on the door, and pretty soon we'd be packing up again. Eventually, I figured it out and asked her, Mom, can't you get them to pay you more? She just laughed and said, Oh, baby, baby, that's not the way the world works. Then she kissed me and said, Don't you worry your pretty head about it. Everything is fine. But one day, while I was having my after-school snack, there was a knock on the door, and a gruff voice shouted, Police! Open up! Mom grabbed me by the wrist and pulled me into the bedroom. Hide here, she whispered, pushing me under the bed. Why? I asked. What's wrong? Shh, baby, shh, she told me. Don't make a peep. Stay right there. I was quiet, but I didn't say put. I crawled over to a hole in the wall that my mother had covered up with a drawing I'd done at school. I peeled the picture back and watched and listened, and that's how I found out that my mother was in trouble for stealing money out of hotel rooms. It took two days for her to come back from the police station. It took two weeks to get us to get... <sighs> done it. It took two weeks for us to get kicked out of the apartment. It was the last real home we ever had.